Sister of the Mad Accused is making headlines tonight for about 24 hours. She was asking you to help her pay for her wedding. Amber Roof says she and her fiancé were forced to cancel the big day after the shooting. In her post on GoFundMe, she says the money would pay for wedding cost bills and to send them on their dream honeymoon. Well, this outraged many of you, but some people donated. It raised at least $1,500. That was then pulled down a couple of hours before our newscast. WBTV's Pamela Escobar is following this story for us. So, Pamela, do we know who actually deleted the site? Yeah, Paul, spokesperson with GoFundMe who hosted the page explained that the organizer voluntarily took it down. The company did not. And this was out after a lot of public pressure as people were commenting, posting on the page saying that we need to remember the nine victims who died. Now, Amber Ro Roof, fundraiser was named a fresh start for Michael and Amber. She wrote how the couple had to approach abruptly canceled their wedding due to the tragedy in Charleston. She said it was canceled to protect family and to mourn the lives lost. She asked to have a chance to start their lives on a positive note. She wanted $5,000 and wrote 10% would be donated to the church in Charleston. The page had raised more than $1,000 when people started posting negative comments. Those comments were deleted. Melissa Williams Stewart from Charlotte wrote she thought it was insane to ask people to donate for a honeymoon. At the end of the day, you asking the public for money for you, opposed to asking the public for money to help these people bury their family, their family members or the people that they love that's now gone. You know, she can always get that wedding back. They will never get their family members back. Now, there were people who had sympathy for Amber Roof and her fiance. She did raise um, over $1,600 before the page was taken down. One woman wrote that her brother was selfish, too, and also ruined special events. I did try to reach out to Amber Roof, but she did not respond to any of my messages. Reporting live in Charlotte, Pamela Escobar, WBTV on your side.